Welcome, this video is on the foot. My mother asked me the other day, what video are you doing now, son? I said, I'm doing a video on the foot. Well, the foot, why would you do one on the foot? Well, she thought I was talking about the foot or feet. And I said, no, mother, I'm talking about the foot, meaning 12 inches, and how to convert it into hundredths. In the past, in my younger days, I would look at the foot and go, oh, I can't do that. Unfortunately, we have a tendency to make it harder than it really is. So here we have the foot. The foot, or converting it into hundreds, the foot would be one foot at 1.00. And so it's very simple, divide that in two. We have six inches at 0 0.50. Divide six inches by two, we have three inches at 0.25. So if we add 0.25 and 0 0.50, we have 9 inches at 0.75. Are you with me so far? So the next step is to take 3 inches or 0.25, divide that by 3, and we get 1 inch at 0.08333328. If we take that number and times that by two, we get two inches at 0.16666656. And of course, three inches is 0.25. We add one inch to three inches, we get 0.33333328. We add one inch to four, we get five inches at 0.41666656. And Add another inch to 0 0.50, you get this number, 8 inches, 0 0.66666666656, 9 inches, 0 0.75, 10 inches, 0 0.8, and 11 inches, 0.91666656. Now, these numbers my calculator isn't big enough. I'm typically three numbers short. I don't think that's a very big deal because typically all we need to worry about is these first three numbers in calculating concrete. We can ignore the rest of them. Now if we take an inch and divide that by two, we have one half inch at point zero four one six 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 four. We divide a half inch by two, we get one quarter inch, which is 0 0.02083332. We divide a quarter inch by two, we get an eighth inch, which is 0 0.01041666. We divide an eighth inch by two, we get 1 16th inch, 0 0.00520833. And if we divide 1 16th of an inch by Two, we get 1 32nd, which is 0 0.002604166. We can divide 1 32nd by 2, we get 1 64th, which is 0 0.00130283. But what's the point? We're not scientists, we're in construction. Okay, down here along the bottom, I have put by eighth of an inch its associated number. And that is within three more digits of what is displayed here. And as I previously said, my calculator is not big enough. Now in the past, we never had calculators with us. It was a little bit difficult to do things, but nowadays we have this wonderful little instrument called the phone, which also does photographs, video, calculations, anything and everything that we want it to do. So we have no more excuses. Anyway, as you can see, it's not hard to convert one foot into hundreds, and it really doesn't take very long at all. Well, I guess I'm done. I'd like to thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Share this with uh, anyone you think needs it. Feel free to comment and give me your opinions, and I hope you have a tremendous day. 
Now, if you'd like a copy of this drawing, there'll be a link that'll take you to this page where there will be a PDF that you'll be able to download to your computer. You can print it off on a eight and a half by 11 inch sheet of paper, fold it up, keep it in your pocket, take it into the field with you, and therefore you don't have to do so much calculation in the field. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day.